hey hello guys how oh, welcome back to the other interesting uh, video uh, so hope you all are doing good so uh, today we are gonna see about a very interesting topic uh, about loft so by using loft uh, we're gonna create uh, interesting uh, geometry patterns so as you seen in the thumb line the same thing we're gonna create so uh, without wasting much time uh, we'll start with a sketch so today I'm gonna select um, now like uh, like simple sketch and the loft the two options we are going to play so uh, let's start with the uh, you know the base uh, sketch so I'm gonna select the top line and I will go with the uh, center lines as like X and Y so here I will try to create our dimensions I mean the basic sketch for that like I will go with um, 50 mm should be fine and I think uh, this should be your uh, angular one yep yes I'll go with uh, 67.5 and this should be 45 degree yep and yeah this looks good actually okay this is our uh, first initial uh, position so now what I'm gonna do here is like I'll just offset this up uh, a top plane of uh, around 20 mm yes this could be our total height uh, where we are going to create a, a point how do we create a point so that's going to be very interesting like what I'm going to do here is I'm going to create a center line to connect with all the three intersecting points so now I'm going to select these three um, center lines and I will make a equal so that the point will be at the center of the triangle okay so so now uh, we have a point here to create a loft so the interesting fact is like uh, we needed to profile for to create a loft so the first profile could be this the base a and the separate, second profile uh, we can also go with a, a closed loop and then the more interesting topic here is like we can also create with a point so this how it used to get great so we don't need to use much you know the guy goes to connect with all these things just a point it could be enough uh, for creating this loft so the first uh, profile is ready so I'm gonna hide this so what I'm gonna do here is like I'll just mirror this mm, uh, so to me I just want to create the plane over here and I will try to take this as a reference so that it will be created as a you know perpendicular to that uh, face yes so now I'm gonna create another profile I like body to be mirror yes and I'll remove this image uh, solid so since we have this very uh, you know zero uh, point so I don't want to merge and it will get an error in that so if you could see here it will not allow to create the body as a merge as you know it's very zero thickness so we'll go with a separate body you now yes so our profile is get ready now so again I'm gonna select the top line or the face of that so now the interesting thing is like I'm gonna create a, a basic profile for us exactly so I will create this as a collinear and uh, this is our outer body so here what I will do here is like let's select the center point and yes this should be a parallel uh, with this uh, you know line and that's how the geometry yeah you can also create the as per your you know the way how you want however so now I'm gonna create the point and go touch here and I'm gonna create this so this uh, let it be two as a parallel and this let it be as this to our parallel to the surface and this point I just want to match with this and I want to create this as a because since these are our profile so I don't want to uh, you know uh, play with the 
external profiles so I just want to create a closed loop exactly so this is how I used to create the closed loops and this also to be a center line for us now this has been created and this also be created for us so now uh, what we're gonna do here is we'll create this point and this should be yes I think here we can make yes perfect and this also to be a closed loop okay good so now we are gonna do here is like well, yes it has to be collinear and this has to be measured with this profile yeah perfect so now uh, this has to be at the center line so here we go with that and also we'll try with a different thing angle uh, maybe uh, this should be for us a 25 yes and these two lines should be 42.8 and this two if you measure it should be same like 37 mm -hmm. let's see let's try to mirror this profile this this oops yes 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 yep and yeah this will anyway it will be there actually yes so this has to be here so I just want to create this line okay let it be like this and okay I'll create this profile and I will remove this line so then it will be like yep and we'll delete this angle and we'll go with the line with this so that when I mirror, so it will be I uh, know aligned with this point. So this is our this, you know, intersection point for us. So yeah, now these points are get ready, and now I'm gonna create a center points. I mean uh, the points to create a loft. I think uh, these three should be uh, equal. So I got this point, and similarly. Anyway, this should be a straight, yes, and this also could be a cross section, so that's point this ready now. So, here, yes, I'm gonna create this point, and three should be, I think, if you make it equal, it will, yes, exactly. So, I don't want like this, so what I'll do is I will just align with this point and will make this constraint and I will also make some dimension for this that could be five yes let it be like this now our points are ready these these and these okay these all points are getting ready now and so I again I just was looking for this profile I'm gonna create a, again a center line yes let it be straight and let's make okay so this could be good actually so now uh, for the other profile so one two three four uh, this is a fifth profile okay oops sorry and this exactly yep and these three are construction or yep and I just want to make this as a symmetry as we know this angle could be 12.5 at the center and I will also make this to 10 fine good so again this profile I just need it as a separate line and also this to be connected with this so yes perfect so all the profiles are ready now so quickly we are gonna create a loft by selecting the contour so as you know like I'm gonna select this I always go with this like if you select it will be selected as a dope actually and also will help you to select the other conditions but 
here it, it, it will not help you to create other points when it comes so go with this also you can select the multiple lines each time and okay I forgot to say that so second profile is not ready so we have to create other profile so since we have created this as a 20 I will try try with this other profile of um, flip and go for 10 yes that makes sense for me you yeah, can also go try with different you know heights as per your need so now how this plane i will try with a uh, multiple points so where i need here here and here these two profiles and here and here too yes sorry think of this sketch we when we create a point is not required and maybe this should be fine for creating a loft yes so <coughs> so i'm gonna select a loft i'll go with this profile 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 all these become as our one profile and third perfect i will go select yes automatically become as so you know without merged with the bodies okay so i, I supposed to enable two of uh, sketches so that i can able to see the profile so i have to select these 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 and this i will select okay and go with the um, second profile again this looks good and select okay again repeat the same with the loft with this profile and I'm gonna select OK and the second profile should be for me at uh, this perfect so good you can just try with the different like you know height so that you know it will not be like too much uh, height for you like you can try this too with a 5 mm uh, from the base you know I just try with a 10 but still we can go with the multiple options so I'll go with um, loft again. I'm gonna select this, 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 and second point could be this. Okay, oops. Yes, yes, this could looks good uh, since I I just made a you know a specific height so that it looks like you know half the way of um, a triangle. So it looks when you you know do the other uh, components, it looks very good so yes this is done and i will try to go with this option i mean i mean this profile so let's go with on loft again so i will select this profile now and go to be a second that is perfect so these three are to be mirrored with this profile so what i'm gonna do here is like i will select again these two points and go with this parallel yes okay good and keeping that as a reference we'll go with the mirror and bodies this 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 so we we'll got selector and okay perfect now we can add this profile as you can see this from the top view uh, our geometry is ready so uh, now uh, the interesting thing is like again uh, we have to create another profile uh, i mean uh, this plane uh, to mirror this profile yes and but i need this point exactly so i will select okay and mirror this chick 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 okay good good to go perfect so as you can see here this square is now ready uh, even you can use this as a single square for your you know um, 3d print or you know for the wall mounting it would be great even you can also make a uh, different colors and you can make a frame of that by but you have to make sure this has to be merged as a, a single body now we have a 20 body theory so before do that so what i'm going to do here is like i will gonna create an axis yes so i'm going to select the point and any uh, parallel surface so i'm gonna select this now uh, we have an option a uh, circular pattern and i will gonna select all the bodies i mean okay to be selected all the bodies i don't know 
okay i will select manually check 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 so just a comment if you have any clarifications or you know queries which we have at any time you can just comment in the comment sections i'm uh, ready to help you guys so now i'll select okay so our complete square is ready uh, so now i hope you like this design yep so now you can color as you want or you know even you can play with this same you know um, single color design so what i'll do is i'll just combine oops but and now we can't combine as you know it's all a uh, zero so we cannot use this option as it will show an error yes exactly because we know already it's not going to be a great as like that so uh, what i will suggest is like i will just create a frame yes I'll just create a frame as you seen in combine similarly i will going to create or probably i will use the center point center and yes this mode is my center point yes i will go with this offset of uh, 20 and this also should be at 20 perfect so i will extrude and create a base of fire map should be fine and merge with the same body so now you can see this body is got merged yes you can see this so if you want you can do the 3d printing of complete uh, you know geometry and you can frame it or if you are looking for any you know kind of a wall uh, so that you can just print it as before you can see and uh, you can start you know uh, mounting with your wall so again yeah it looks good uh, so please you know comment if you have any clarification and if you're looking for a new geometry uh, please uh, give a you know um, comment uh, saying that if you want a new design i'm ready to give in more upcoming videos so thanks for watching and please do subscribe and give, you know like and share with your friends who, who are looking for you know this kind of uh, geometry patterns until then, um, bye from now and we will see you in the next video. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.